Hi everyone, I'm Aaron Rump, and what we're going to do today is a quick setup on engraving on a tool room mill. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my edit mode, I'm going to go down to disk directory, I'm going to find the program that I want, which is going to be this one, and then it's going to start loading it. It will put it right here. So right here it does tell me that X, Y, zero is my text starting location. Now, you got two ways you can do this. You can indicate this corner and then move your program over. But for what I'm doing right now, I just want to give my text a starting location. So I'm going to go into handle and I'm going to move over to a nice spot that I think will work just fine. So right there, it's nothing too fancy. I've just got it located where I want my text to start right here. I'll come down in Z and I'll use a piece of paper to set my length. So I'll come down until my paper doesn't move once it's there. So I have a, a, a location, I have a Z height. All I'm gonna do is go into my offsets. I'm gonna make sure I'm on G54 because my program uses G54 and I'm gonna hit part zero set, part zero set for my X and my Y. I'll come back to my tool one geometry and I'll hit tool offset measure. That's all I need to do. So from here, I go memory, current commands, settings graphics, I want to see if it's going to run. So you can see right there that it is going to run. And then from here, I'm just going to hit play. So I'll hit reset, memory, current commands, cycle start. So right there, you can see that I easily have engraved my name onto the part. So for doing a setup and doing your engraving, this is all you'll need to know. So from here you can make it deeper or you can run it a couple times and so on and so forth. You'll figure out what's going on. Again, thank you for watching. My name is Aaron Runt. Hope this helps.